There we have a loaded out eight and a half by 26 enclosed race ready trailer. Got several different options on it. You got a power awning here on the side. You got race lights on the outside, speakers on the outside for your radio. Exterior receptacle. Inside you got the four speakers on the inside. Two four foot LED lights in the ceiling, double AC units, cabinets up front, toolbox. We'll get back to inside here in a minute. This is done with the spread axles underneath it. Got aluminum mag wheels with torsion, 5,200 pound axles. All screwless exterior, no screws in this. All glued on with heavy duty sealant. Gives you a smoother look. Pull out step, 48 inch wide double side door. Three piece tongue on it, an extended tongue. We built this one with the ultimate escape door here on the side. And of course, you got the generator box as well. But the ultimate escape door, pretty much the whole side of the trailer lifts up. You got about eight foot wide and about five and a half foot tall. And then you can pull your fender out and get those low car doors open. Got a step between it, step up inside or outside. These all have radial tires. This is the bigger 16 inch tires or wheels. Tires are 235, 80, R16s, heavy duty 10 ply tires. Then back to the inside here, we got a loaded out inside. You get cabinets up front, base cabinets, overhead cabinets, closet, toolbox. You got your radio there. There's a work light here above the table you got your panel box here your converter for the 12 volts and your battery light up top for the workbench here you got an L-shaped cabinet here because you got your generator that would be where the generator stores and opens up from the outside. Closet with a shelf and a coat, coat rack here. You see the speakers there for the radio up in the coves of the corners of the trailer. This trailer here has semi or screwless interior walls as well as outside silver frost. Carpet below 36 inches. Aluminum ceiling as well. Interior height on this trailer is 80 inches. And here you got your switches. One for the outside race lights and then one for the lights on the awning. Goes all the way down the trailer. This trailer has a 50 amp electrical. You can see one of the receptacles there. And the other one farther back there. There are also be light switches here to run the outside lights back here or the interior lights so you don't have to walk all the way to the front got a dovetail so it slopes down here in the back end makes it easier to get your car in or taller stuff you got a little bit taller stuff because that little bit usually you lose for the spring assist there we've got the extra ride ramp door on it Spoiler with lights in the spoiler too for loading. Again, this is an eight and a half by 26 race ready trailer loaded out, built by Covered Wagon. 